Three weeks ago, Emily Bates buried her grandma. Here is my grandmother, Katrina. She raised me and my three siblings. On July 2nd at 2 p.m., Katrina went to get groceries. She picked up two people in her car. She was pronounced deceased at like 437. According to a Knoxville police report, at 437, one unknown woman knocked on the door of Fire Station 15. They said this lady needs help, so they ran out to the vehicle. She was in the back seat, unresponsive, so they took her out of the car and started doing CPR. The report says the two people wouldn't answer any questions and drove off. Police later found the car at a gas station in Coryton. The keys were under her seat. Her phone was sitting up where she always kept it. Behind the driver's side, there was a needle cap in the floorboard. She did not use drugs. She was terrified of needles. One of her nails are completely broken off. Although the case is being investigated by KPD's drug-related task force, Emily feels there may be more to it. You know, it's just so many things, like so many factors.